Good morning, and welcome to our Thanksgiving prayer service. Each year at this time, we give God thanks for all we receive through the Spirit during the summer and into the fall. The rains of April and May soften the ground so that it is ready for planting crops that will feed us through the rest of the year. A good summer and fall harvest brings us so much to be thankful for. The glorious fall colors come alive in the sun's light. They move us to wonder and praise for God's gift of life. Let us take a few moments now to give thanks to our God, beginning with the sign of our faith. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. A reading from the letter from Paul to the Colosseans. Let the peace of Christ rule in your hearts and be thankful. Let the word of Christ dwell in you richly. Teach and instruct one another in all wisdom and with thanksgiving in your hearts. Sing psalms, hymns, and spiritual songs to God. And whatever you do, in word or deed, do everything in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to God the Father through him. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. After each verse, please say, we thank you, O God. O God, it is right for us to praise you and keep our promises to you. Because in your own time and in your own way, you answer prayer. So we say, we thank you, O God. You show your care for the land by sending rain. You make it rich and fertile. You fill the streams with water. You provide the earth with crops. And we say, we thank you, O God. You send abundant rain on the plowed fields and soak them with water. You soften the soil with showers and cause the young plants to grow. What a rich harvest your goodness provides. And so we say, we thank you, O oh God. Wherever you go, there is plenty. The pastures are filled with flocks. The hillsides are full of joy. And so we say, we thank you, O oh God. Listen to the words of the gospel according to St. Matthew. At that time, Jesus said, I thank you, Father, Lord of heaven and earth, because you have hidden these things from the wise and the intelligent and have revealed them to children. Yes, Father, for such was your gracious will. Come to me, all you that are weary and are carrying heavy burdens, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you, and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy, and my burden is light. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Thanksgiving to me means giving thankful to friends and loved ones, showing love to your loved ones and friends especially the food. Best part of Thanksgiving is obviously the food. The pie, the potatoes, mac and cheese, green beans, and the gravy. 
I also love it when people dress up just to sit and talk in the living room for three hours. I find it funny. Long story short, Thanksgiving means a lot to me. And I appreciate the holiday, especially when my family and friends come over to hang out. What does Thanksgiving mean to me? Well, when you think of Thanksgiving, you probably think of the turkey, mashed potatoes, and the football game. While that is all a part of it, Thanksgiving to me is the time when family and friends come together to celebrate and give thanks to God for the many gifts he has given us, such as our family, friends, education, and health. We appreciate our blessings and remember those who are less fortunate than us. This Thanksgiving, by donating food, we have played a part in making a great Thanksgiving for all. Have a wonderful Thanksgiving. The response to our prayers is, Lord, hear our prayer. For the gift of our country and for the gift of peace, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the gift of our land and all its beauty, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the gift of our food and the farmers who grow it for us, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the gift of our parents, those who care for us, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For the gifts of Holy Savior Kevin, our teachers, and all who help us to live the light of faith, we pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Let us now add our own intentions and prayers to bless thanks to God. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. We are God's sons and daughters, and to trust in God who gives us all good things, let us bring the prayers we have spoken and those still in our hearts before him, using the words that Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. by sending Jesus, who showed us the way to live together in love. Through your gift of baptism, you made us one with Jesus, so that we could share in his rising from the dead and be with you forever. We thank you all for all the blessings you give us. They remind us of your goodness and care. Help us to always be thankful and ready to share what you have given us, so that people might know the everlasting love and kindness you give in Christ. We make this prayer to you through Christ our Lord, and may Almighty God bless us all in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please stand and join in singing American Music. 